The materials used to build recreational vehicles today has sure changed since our family first started camping. That's why here at Keystone RV, we consistently look for newer, stronger, and lighter weight material to use in the build process of our RVs. As a matter of fact, we've dedicated an entire facility to just building sidewalls of our campers. When it comes to the construction of your camper sidewall, two things are critically important, temperature and humidity. That's why it is my job here at this 250,000 square foot facility to make sure temperature and humidity are just right so we can produce the best sidewalls possible. For instance, on a day like today, humidity is low, so we're constantly pumping humidity into the air. Moisture is critical, especially for the material like Luon. I don't know if you can see it or not, but today we're pumping a lot of humidity into this room. And the temperature has to be just right for the material and the adhesive to do the job they're expected to do. We want to build strong and durable sidewalls. Sidewalls that will outlast your coach. That's why we've invested millions of dollars in this environmentally controlled building so we can and do build the best sidewalls possible. As you can see, this wall is huge. 40 feet long, nine feet tall. A lot of elevations and a lot of intricate angles. It's one of the most complicated walls that we build. We program the dimensions of a sidewall into the CNC's computer directly from the engineer's drawing. Then it goes to work routing out exactly what these drawings called for. We build this wall within one one hundredth of an inch of tolerance. That's how we're able to build complex sidewalls like these that fit exactly the way they're supposed to. You might not know this, but on the inside of your RV is an aluminum superstructure that is critical to the strength and integrity of your unit. That's why it is important to build it right every time. This is how other companies do it. They partially weld on one side, and because of that, it easily cracks or breaks. In order to make our frame stronger, we run our welds along the full length of the tube. Not only that, we weld all the tubes that run from top to bottom of your wall on both sides, adding even more strength and integrity to the frame. That's why our frames are able to absorb the pounding and jarring that your RV takes over the years, unlike others that we know. Along the line, everybody is responsible for putting out the best camper possible, and we take the construction of our walls very, very seriously. Nothing gets past me. If I find something that doesn't make the grade, it goes back the line to be made correct. We leave nothing to chance, so we run destructive tests throughout the day, every day, to verify your walls are built right. This wall failed at 193 pounds of pressure. That is way more than what your RV wall will ever experience. As manufacturing manager, it is my responsibility to make sure that everyone builds the highest quality sidewall possible. 